Hey, hey, it's Lamar Scholl here coming at you from DirectionToSuccess.com. How you doing today? Hope your day's going awesome. I love when that happens. Listen, we're going to talk about the info banner element that comes with the Jack Oliver template that's part of the East Stage theme. It's awesome. This little nugget is easy to use and does a lot for your web pages. And what the info banner element, sorry, the info banner element, what that does, it actually displays an image and then you can superimpose two headings of text over top of that. It looks pretty sharp. It's real easy to use. So what I'm going to do, we're going to slide all the way over to my computer screen and we're going to just show you a little sample page here of what I've got. I've already got one put in just a little mock-up here for us and what it is the elements here at the top of the page this is where you'll find it so this blue light bulb is the image that I put in there so it looks pretty neat right and I got these awesome striking head headings right heading one and heading two how do you like that so that's what it's gonna look like when it's done so the the logo here and the menu that's all part of other controls it's not part of the info banner element okay but it that's what's nice about it, right it we just slip it up there and it, it puts everything over top that you need so that's good right so what I'm gonna do now we're gonna step over here and go into the WordPress dashboard so here's my page and again here's the info banner section element that we're using right so what I'm gonna do I'll, I'll just show you where to find it so I'm just going to go down here and create a new one and then well actually what we'll do yeah so it's not confusing we'll just delete this one how's that so we'll come into here and now we come into our add element page and again here's all the the um, I think I've mentioned this before in in past videos we have all all the elements that we're talking about that come with the Jack Oliver theme start with J-O, right? The Joe elements. <laughs> so there's quite a few here and we're going to eventually go through all these. But right now, I want to talk about the info banner section. So we're going to click on this. So here's our info banner settings window. And you can see this section up here is where we're going to add the image. And then here's where we're going to add our two headings. And that's it. And then we're done. So what I want to show you is that was saying my background image. So here's the size. It's going to be 1920. So that's 1920 wide, right? 1920 pixels wide by 550 pixels high or tall, however you want to look at it. All right. So we're going to go in here. And I'm just going to select this image here. I don't know, this orange sky. It looks pretty cool to me. But you notice right now it's at 756 pixels tall, right? So not a problem. So right in WordPress, we're going to crop this image down so it's only 550 pixels tall. So it works with our, with our info banner, right? There's nothing to it. This is all fun. So just bear with me here a bit all right there's our image and for me I don't know about you guys but what I'm doing now so I want to take this image and I really just want to crop it down so it's 550 pixels tall I use the selection over here right so I can get close you know the numbers and I don't know how to get it started I usually myself I just make a I just drag the mouse across the section and then I come over here and I put in my values. So the first value that we enter is the width. And we know we want it 920, right? So you can see how it made the change over here in the upper left. But obviously our image is not quite tall enough. So we want to put in here 550. So now you notice we have the light section down here at the bottom, near the bottom. So that's our rectangle if you will that we have selected this darker area on top and this little thin strip down here 
those are what will be cropped out once we tell it to do that but you can actually change it so you might want to grab the darker edge up here so I'm all the way to the top or you can grab all the light goodness down in the bottom right or somewhere in the middle like it was you know when it first appeared or we had a moment ago but I want to grab the lighter stuff so I'm grabbing all the I'm gonna just take this image and I want to crop the bottom or I'm gonna crop the top so there you go that was the update and now we just hit save and there she is so we are gonna go back to pages so it was called test info banner page and this is our info banner section right here we're gonna go and edit hit the plus so we can add the picture select the image okay so now I want to change the heading here right so we can say something like um, let's get started with direction and goals then the next line welcome to my home on the net whoops Back up the net we go over here and preview the page so you can see now here's our new image right and um, the reason why it's dark that's part of the Jack Oliver theme it actually puts a dark shade and then right now it escapes me what you what you call it but that's what's going on there so here's the two titles we just added in right just let's get started with our direction and goals welcome to my home on the net and that's it that's how easy that is to use they're not always hard right I think that's that's pretty cool like I said you want to you know use this at the top of your web pages right so again I want to thank you for taking your time to watch this video and I hope you enjoyed it and if you have any questions on eStage the info banner element WordPress Leave your comments below or anything else that's related. I'll be glad to answer them. Thank you very much. Have a great day.